sometimes is outrage culture. I was in the States and a friend of mine was showing me a hate Trump dating app. <laughs> now, if you hate Trump, that's totally fine. I could see why you would, but should that be the sole basis of a relationship? <laughs> it's like, you hate Trump, I hate Trump. Let's get together and have sex and think about why much we hate that orange piece of shit. Oh, I fucking hate him. He's such a misogynistic, homophobic, racist piece of shit. I hate him. I hate him and it turns me on how much I hate him. Oh, if we have sex and we think about, think about him getting impeached, it'll impeach him. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. God, I want to, you know what I want to do? I want to have hate sex with Donald Trump. Talk like Trump to me. Talk like Trump to me. That'll really turn me on. You know what? You're doing a great job. You're doing a tremendous job. I feel a winner behind me. I feel a winner inside me. That's right, you're huge, you're huge. I wasn't gonna say it, but I am gonna say it. I'm gonna come. I'm gonna come. I'm gonna make coming great again. Mark my words, mark my words. Oh, 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 fake orgasm, you're fired. <laughs> I'm glad you guys laughed at that because I did that bit in Northern Alabama. What the hell are you trying to say, boy? 